Hey guys, it's Greg from East Coast Eyes, and today is Veterans Day. So we'd like to take a moment and remember all the veterans that served and all the soldiers that still serve today and protect our country and our freedom. So in honor of Veterans Day, I decided to pull out an old classic and restring it for today. So today we have a head that you guys have seen before. It was the head that released one of the first striker meshes we already did ever did um, about a year ago probably I guess more than a year ago now so it is a fully custom STX stallion that I dyed uh, and I completely restrung it today and it looks really sweet much cleaner than before and I really love it this is one of my favorite heads that I have ever done so people always ask how I did it this head was actually done with marbling spray so it's got the royal and then the rustic flag look down at the bottom with the white and red stripes that have some marbling through them. So what I did was I just sprayed marble sparsely through the top, dyed it royal blue, and then sprayed marble spray on really, really thick in the white areas. Um, as thick as I could, got really close with the can, and then when you peel it off, you get some pretty solid white lines with just a little red marbling through them. Overall, it turned out perfect, and I love this head. So uh, it's got USA right there on the top, ECD and 28 on the back, which are my number is my number, and I uh, decided to go with a gray theme in the pocket, so put in a piece of solid gray, 15 millimeter East Coast mesh, uh, kind of replicate the Team USA helmets that they wore, the matte grays. Uh, it looks really sick, so it's got the 50 mil gray, white top string, white sidewalls, white in the throat, a red nylon, and two gray and black striker shooters in a straight configuration. For the pocket, I uh, strung it up with the Kyle Harrison stallion pattern, uh, which really don't know, I have tutorial. It's a great pocket for the stallion. I recommend it to almost everyone. So you guys can check that out here on YouTube. Uh, but the pocket sits kind of mid, mid-high. It's pretty deep, nice and defined, and it's gonna give you a ton of whip. He usually has it with a nylon and two U's, uh, but I decided to just do two straights just to keep it clean. Nice to find mid pocket, nice channel, and overall a great pocket for the stallion from the player that designed the head. So I uh, hope you guys like this head. Make sure to take a second and thank any veterans that you know and take a second to think about the troops today. Uh, make sure to like if you liked it, subscribe if you haven't, and have a great day.